会。Okay, I'm a water type, and that was a water attack. It's okay, I'm fine. Oh, cool. Well, uh, shall we? Uh, hello. I heard you need help. That's a pretty big pocket monster over there you're fighting. What? I can help. Uh, I think I'm fine. I'm coming. All right, I'm here to save the day. Let's go, Bulbasaur. Shoop. E yeah. Poof. Uh, okay, I'll watch. All right, Bulbasaur. Let's take it on. Uh oh, wait, hold on. It's gonna do a hydro pump again. Blur. Ooh, that was nice. What? It did nothing? Heh heh heh. No water attack's gonna work on a grass Pokemon. Grass loves water. Now it's our turn. Bulbasaur, attack! No, no, no. It is done. Huh? Uh, 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 uh. Huh. Leech seed? Yep, pretty cool, huh? All right, I guess now's our chance. Star you, recover! Good job, Staryu. Your injuries are healed. Whoa, that's a cool trick. <laughs> All right, let's do a double attack. All right, let's try it. Bulbasaur. Staryu? Blubber. Fine whip. Bubble beam. Vine whip. And now for the Pokeball. Hey, 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 hold on. I got it. Yeah. All right, I got it. Yahoo! Good work. I wish I could have caught it though. Whew. Uh, thanks a lot. Um, Red. Red's my name. Catch. Thanks. You know, I didn't expect to see a Pokemon that big. And, like, not around here of all places. Was it wild, or was it... Yeah, Gyarados here is a, a water Pokemon. It's not really supposed to live in habitats like this, like 
This is close to the mountains, you know? Huh. Yeah, I figured. So, what's it doing here? Uh, that Gyarados wasn't wild. It's, uh, <laughs> it's my Pokemon. Say what? Yeah, I was raising it until last week. Then somebody stole it. When it came back, it wasn't the sweet Gyarados I knew anymore. I've been tracking it. Not hard to do since it's been destroying everything in its path. <sighs> anyway, thanks for the help. Everything's okay now. No, it's not. It's never okay when a Pokemon goes berserk. Those guys who stole Gyarados must be responsible for this. I'm gonna go kick their butts. <sighs> now hold on a minute. Uh. Where do you think you're going? Where? I'm, uh... Huh. Where did you say those thieves were? If I knew, don't you think I'd be there? Come on, you idiot! Hmm... Pokemon thieves. Maybe the professor knows something about that. He sure deals with a lot of them. Huh? Alright, let's see if I remember his number. Uh, uh, hmm. All right. So, uh, now what? Hold on. Give him a second. Go for Oak. Oh, hello, Red. Long time no see. This is Professor Oak. He's the world's leading expert on Pokemon. Oh, shucks. I remember in episode one you thought I was an old bag. <laughs> Anyways, there are hundreds of varieties of Pokemon, you know, scattered all over the Earth. How's that Pokedex looking, Red? As a matter of fact... It's <laughs> looking great. I even got some new data today. Look at this. Whoa, it says Gyarados is a water Pokemon. Oh, a Pokedex? What's that? So whenever I catch a Pokemon, its data automatically gets inputted. You know, so I want to input all the data on all the Pokemon to have a complete Pokédex. That's my goal in life. I'll have to fight wild Pokémon and tough trainers on the way. But I'll be a top Pokémon trainer myself one of these days. Oh, that's right. Professor Oak, that's why we called. Oh, yeah? I've got a question. Do you know anybody who steals Pokémon? Other than you, kid? <laughs> hmm, let me think. Well, there was someone who stole something from my lab earlier today. Actually, this thief made my Pokemon go all berserk when I got it back. Hmm. Huh. Curious. You know what? That sounds like the doings of Team Rocket. Team Rocket? Yep, Team Rocket. It's a secret society that uses Pokemon for evil. Recently, they're rumored to be conducting lab experiments on Pokemon. Kind of like what you do? Uh, no, uh, that's a little different. Using Pokemon for lab experiments? Distressing, I know. But there is something you can do to help. You know, on Mount Moon, which should be nearby, you guys, just to the east, there's supposed to be a moonstone. A moonstone? What's that? A stone that they say is from the moon. Cool. 
cool, but how does that help us? Well, they also say that the stone can boost the power of a Pokemon. So, Team Rocket's probably after the stone so they can boost the power of their Pokemon. Oh. Oh. Cool. Thanks for the help, Professor. Click. Bzz. That does it. I can't wait to complete the Pokedex, but... Whew. First, I'm going to find these Team Rocket guys, and I'm going to kick their... Hey, wait for me. You're not going to kick them alone. What? I'm going to kick their butts, too. Uh, what? But you're a girl. Well, <laughs> didn't you see earlier I helped you fight my Gyarados? And check it out. I've got a bunch of Pokemon. I'm a Pokemon trainer. By the way, Mount Moon's on the way home, so, you know, <laughs> I might as well go with you. Well, okay, I guess. Also, I'm a water Pokemon trainer. And my water Pokemon can totally have advantages over rock Pokemon, which is pretty cool. So, you know, I can hold my own. Cool. My name is Misty. Nice to meet you. I'm from Cerulean City. Let's go to Mount Moon. Okay. <laughs> oh, by the way. Yeah? Do you know what a rotten egg is? Uh... Isn't it just an egg that goes bad? True, but it's what the last one there will be. Haha, <laughs> see ya, sucker! Hey, wait, uh, I don't want to be a rotten egg. Uh, wait. 